Great seeing you. Congratulations. As we are here in Toronto, it's the kickoff of the Toronto Black Film Festival. How's it feel being back here on this snowing day in Toronto, knowing that you're going to be bringing the heat with these great, great films? Oh, well put. I'm telling you. Thank you so much for being here. Um, we're so proud because that is our most diverse selection yet at the Toronto Black Film Festival. Seventh edition, the festival is really going bigger and more and way faster than anticipated. So we're very proud. We're very happy to see that it was a packed house today for the press conference. And uh, we're having 70 films from 26 countries. And um, this is uh, as diverse as I have, I, you can have. There's something for everybody. What are some of the films that we're going to see? I know you can't mention all 70 and you said uh, Diverse from comedy to documentaries to dramas, so many different things, even the horror too. Yes. What are some of the films that we're going to get a chance? Well, we're launching the festival with a fantastic true story uh, movie. Um, it's very powerful called Elen, the Elen Paki story from South Africa. Actually, it was South Africa's choice for the Golden Globe. Um, we're having um, a closing film that is a knockout film um, called Dead Women Walking from the United States. It's about women on the death row um, in a jail and uh, very, very powerful, very tough. We have two centerpieces, um, one called We Are the Heat. Um, it's from Colombia. It's about art and dance and then gangsterism and everything else. But more, um, more so, it's about humanity. It's about how art can save you, can save our youth. Um, we're having also Sprinter. It's for a film from Jamaica. Um, we don't often have film from Jamaica. Let me tell you that we're very, very proud and happy. Um, and uh, it's about um, a young guy that want to be a sprinter, that want to run and everything else. And, uh, and now how do you do the, 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 good, the, the good choice when um, you're living in poverty and at the same time, you know, there's constant, uh, you know, um, threat of, you know, doing the bad thing too, the easiest things, you know, those kind of things. So we're having um, a kids' corner as well. That's what I want to get into because you make sure that the kids are celebrated in this yes. Oh yes, oh yes. I think um, my favorite of all, it's the TBFF Kids Film Festival. I mean, there's nothing um, more fulfilling than seeing packed theaters with kids watching movies. And they get it, they get it. I mean, they ask questions and then, uh, I mean, this is fantastic. And it's important to have our kids see themselves on screen. It's important to have them um, have role models on screen, you know? So this is what we're trying to do. And on top of the films for the kids, we also have on Family Day um, a bunch of activities and workshops for them the whole day from 11 to 5 at the Colton Cinema. So there's something for everybody. We have a food corner, we have live performances, we have tons of films, we have kids' events, um, we have a great Q&A discussion and tribute to Tawana Burke the Me Too founder. Um, she will be coming to the festival. We've been trying to have Terana Burke for the longest time. Um, she has a very busy schedule, so we're very proud that she could make some time to come to Toronto at the Toronto Black Film Festival on February 16th at Isabel Bader Theatre. So it's gonna be a great, great night. We only have 500 seats and tickets are chips, cheap, so um, cheap, so um, make sure you grab your tickets right now. And, and then. And I gotta jump in, and it's running from when to when? Oh, Film Festival? Um, February 13th till the 18th. And when do we, where do we get our info from? ToronoBlackFilm.com. Great talking to you. Thank you.